hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's been a sigma here it's obvious that you probably have erased your device that has find my iphone 10 on typically with three youtubes or itunes that is how come you uh, come across iphone lock to owner or icloud activation lock so in today's video i'll be showing you guys how to use the Tenor share for me key activation unlock software to mitigate or remove the effect of the icloud activation lock on your iOS devices now this tool it's a standalone software that is available for um, unlocking both iPhones, iPad and iPod Touch. Also, it supports up to the latest iOS 16.5.1. That is obviously the latest iOS version. Before we dive into this video, if you are new to this channel, kindly do me a favor and smash the subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified anytime you upload the content like this. Okay, so real quick, you want to go ahead and open your web browser and search for the tenorshare.com. Just as you can see in the video, or you can go ahead and co um, open the link directly from the description below to download the software. Now, this is how the website looks like the Tenorshare official website. Now, we have some multiple programs or multiple softwares over here. We have the, the iPhone screen unlocker, we have the Android screen unlocker, we have the iCloud activation unlocker, we have all we also have the backup tool and then the password manager. These are all softwares by Tenorshare. There are multiple tools here. You can go ahead and check them out. Now, what we need here is the activation or the iPhone activation lock software. That is the third one under the password tab. So you just go ahead and click on that one and scroll down all the way down to the section that you have to um, see this prominent button showing download, free download. You can go ahead and check out some of the features of the tool before downloading. So you just click on the free download button and then the download will start to, uh, it, the download will begin. So as you can see, the download is completed. So just click on it and begin with the installation process. Here we are. So you just need to click on the install to um, install the tool. Alright, so real quick, after the installation process is completed, you'll have to um, click on the start button. Let me just close this real quick. Click on the start button and wait for the tool to launch for the first time. Now, before we start with the bypass process, now let me first explain some of the features of the tool. We have the remove Apple ID. This feature is to turn off the farm iPhone on your open menu devices. This can help you to remove your Apple ID on your open menu devices if you don't know the Apple Apple ID password. Also, we have the turn off camera sound. This feature can also help you to turn off the camera sound on your iOS devices. So um, that is all real quick. Let's start with the iCloud remover. So you just need to click on the start button. That is a prominent button over the start to remove while your device is connected in the activation lock screen and you have to tick the, on the terms and agreement so you just click on the start and the tool will automatically put your device into recovery mode all right so real quick you can see the device is in re recovery mode what you need to do here is to read the instructions very carefully to put your device into dfu mode as you can see in the in the video now, depending on your device type, your um, uh, DFU buttons might be different. So you have to read it carefully in order to put your device into DFU mode. So just as you can see in the uh, video, so you just click on the start button once again and press and hold um, the volume down and the power button simultaneously for five seconds. You release the power button after five seconds and keep holding the volume down for about 10 seconds. And then the device the software will automatically detect the device in dfu mode when when the device is in dfu mode you will not see anything the screen will be blank so here we are the device is in dfu mode now the tool will automatically uh, detect the device in dfu mode and begin with the um, process All 
okay so the jailbreak process has begun so what you need to do here is to just sit patiently and wait for the tool to do it then do not interrupt with the connection all you need to do is just be patient whilst the software jailbreak your device now this process will take some time as you can read on the on the, on the screen it says this process will take up to about 10 to 20 minutes it depends on, depends on your lap um your laptop or your pc or whatsoever and it will be done in no time so all you need to do is to wait Alright, real quick, the jailbreak process is done. So automatically the device will return back into the recovery mode after the jailbreak process is completed. All you need to do is just click start button and over here, just like we did earlier, you just click on the start button again and put the device into the DFU mode, just as we did earlier. So again, you hold the power button and the volume down simultaneously. Keep holding the two buttons. Five after five seconds, you release the power and hold the volume down for about 10 seconds. Now the device will also um, detect it in DFU mode. Now, as you can see, the device is in DFU mode, so the uh, iCloud removal or the bypass process will begin. All right, so so real quick, the bypass process has begun, as you can see in the video. Alright, so real quick, the tool says the bypass is completed and as you can see, the device is rebooting so that you can set it up. The device is successfully bypassed. What you need to do over here is just go ahead and set it up as a fresh device.